Mad fans, this is Mad Money Shop sniffing out the Mad Cheese. So I do got some more plays for you out of the Patriots defensive playbook. Uh, this playbook is my new playbook of choice, and I switched over for a couple reasons. I'm in a CFM now where I'm using a custom book, and I'm dabbling a lot with 3-4, uh, with uh, some new nickel stuff out of the 3-3-5 odd. And I'm really liking what I'm finding. So I'm, I'm, I switched over from my Bengals playbook. There's nothing wrong with the Bengals playbook. Believe me, the Bengals playbook is still, uh, it's right up there with one of the best uh, playbooks in the game. I still think it might be the best defensive playbook in the game. But I want a new challenge, and I'm enjoying uh, the 3-4, which is not in the Bengals. So I fully intend to put out a full breakdown of this video uh, when, I get a, when I get a chance. Hopefully, I'll, I'll drop that link in the description. Uh, I'll retroactively drop that link in the description in these videos. Uh, but other than that, it'll be at some point out in, uh, on my website. Uh, which all that information is in the bottom. But other than that, I want to go ahead and show you guys a really good base defense and a really effective blitz um, that you can really do out of a couple different sets uh, from this formation. This 3-4 odd is like the one of the more popular ones that people use uh, with these cover fours, so I don't really need to show you that. I'm not a huge fan of the cover four, to be honest with you. I, I have no issues beating it. I got a lot of one-play touchdowns against it. Uh, people get stuck doing that, one, that cover four so much that it just becomes obvious and then they get beat deep uh, with some of my one play tees so I'm not, I'm not a huge fan of that plus I don't feel you get a lot of pressure but other than that the play that I do like is the uh, cover two hard flat or the Tampa two you can use either one and I'm going to show you what to do there first I'm going to check my personnel because this uh, <laughs> this defense is not that great I just want to make sure that I have as much speed as possible on the outside uh, I'm guessing this is about as good as it gets Kyle Van Noy and uh, Marquise Flowers you want speed on both sides because those guys are going to be coming uh, so we'll go ahead and pick that. The Tampa 2 is probably better coverage than the hard flats, but you can really convert the cover 2 hard flat. Or the Tampa 2 for that matter, so it doesn't really matter what play you pick. So we'll go ahead and we'll do that. And then on the uh, other side, we're going to go... I was running this against gun, everything. It really doesn't matter. But we're going to go... Uh, we'll go single back. Random single back. Try to match personnel quite a bit. So this is a real simple setup. Nothing too crazy here. Uh, I like bringing in Van Noy a little bit. And then I'll hit the uh, the R the R uh, what was that the R one button yeah the R one button and then uh, I'll blitz the outside linebacker. That's really it. I also like to spread everything. That's an option. But if it's a, if it's a threat to run, you could also pinch the defensive line and you're gonna have really run good run stopping. Just as long as these linebackers are out far enough from the wise blocker, you're gonna see how well of a run stopping play this is. And then you still have really good coverage. You don't need more than two. Uh, you know, you can stay full coverage and not blitz that linebacker if you want to, but you really don't need it. You can, two yellows is enough. Um, you just have to put a little bit more pressure on yourself to get it done. So this is the play. I'll go ahead and I'll let the computer run it. It looks like it's probably going to be a run play. So I got to be uh, I got to be wary of that. You see right there, it doesn't get much less than a yard. So real simple setup. Like I said, I like to spread everything and just blitz this guy. I like to bring him out a little bit more if I can, but it's not the end of the world if you don't have time. I know this is a really simple setup, uh, but you don't always have time to do everything. So there I'd be sucked in a little bit, but you can see how the pressure comes in. I, a good thing is I probably got beat. So you could also, um, you know, uh, like I said, I like to bring these guys out. I want I want that arrow to be pointing at like this angle. I think it's really the best way to go. Uh, but like I said, you could also do a QB contain. You could also bring this guy down and try to bluff blitz him uh, in that gap. For some reason, it's not letting me do the bluff blitz sometimes. I don't even know what that's about. But either way, you, you can bring him down and try to manipulate the blocking a little bit. Uh, it'll, it'll hurt you a little bit when it comes to a run play. But you can see how the play kind of stops it by itself. So let's go ahead and let's drop down in this box again. Like I said, it's not letting me uh, bluff blitz, which is kind of stupid. Uh, because that would be really nice. So I'll QB spy this time. Who really cares? But the QB spy I won't drop me back as dramatically, I don't think. Um, as you can see there, we, we, that, he's got to take the check down. I'm guessing that was heat related. And I had a, I had a gorgeous hit stick going right there. <laughs> so let's go ahead and let's uh, see if that, was, if that was a free pressure player again. Um, not really. Yeah, we get a free man. Okay, so that's what I was expecting. And you can see it's pretty much the same guy every time. He just comes across the grain, and the the that's a really good guard too. I'm pretty sure that's Brandon Brooks, who's like a one of the best guards in the game, and he just keeps whiffing it. On this play, and the last play I showed you guys, I'll pop links for that. That Pro Bowl right guard is not blocking anybody. <clears throat> I think he made the Pro Bowl. He might have been All Pro. I'm not even sure, but he was—he's a beast. Take me, take me for my word. So we're gonna go. Hey, we're gonna go back to. Uh, we're gonna QB spy again. Guess pass, even though I'm not sure. Looks like it might be a run. And we're gonna go. Hey, we're gonna cover these short routes. Nick Foles is taking off. So obviously somebody was coming in because Nick Foles ain't running if you don't have to. Not gonna go back to the replay. So here we're gonna do. Uh, once again, we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna pinch the line because I'm feeling a run coming. 
I'm not in the best position as a run as a run stopper, but you know what? It doesn't matter. Not getting anything. So we'll go ahead and run this one more time. I'll just show you the coverage adjustments, the hard flat. If you choose this play, the hard flat's going to be um, that typically best the hard flat whenever you're sending a blitz. If you want to know the truth about it, uh, but you could always go, uh, you know, hit the triangle button or the Y button, go over top, and it becomes a Tampa two. If you're running a Tampa two, which is in my audibles, um, you could always just do the hard flat adjustment, which is underneath. So it really doesn't matter. Like I was saying, what play you pick. Um, just you know you have uh, You have all these options at your disposal So just be aware of that if you're gonna stop the run too by the way Don't go down the line if you think it's a pass go down the line if you think it's a run drop back uh, and other than that you could always um, You know pinch and stand behind him because this looks like it's probably gonna be a run play So we're gonna go we're gonna pinch and stand behind this guy uh, You can see there all the lanes are pretty much taken up. He did a good job of getting out Like I said, this is not a great defense the Patriots. It's pretty it's pretty stinky. So let's go ahead and let's end the video there um, Like I said, if you guys want to see more Patriots do me a favor to like button and I'll do that other than that Thanks for watching man money shout out if more help or just want to show your support then head over to my patreon and join my team where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays as well as early access to my bits and more link in the description below